recording. Hi, John here. I'm just, I'm just making this video for Tony Fortune from Fortune Manning Lawyers in Auckland. Today on Monday the 19th of March 2018 for the record in Britain, UK, Westminster Government and the High Court of Admiralty in London. Here in New Zealand for the record of the native Marae Magistrate Courts that I've set up, 12 of them so far through the country and to the District Court in Auckland, Supreme Court of New Zealand and the High Court of New Zealand. I'm here acting as a surrogate King William III, a surrogate King William IV and a surrogate King George IV, a surrogate St. Patrick from Northern Ireland, Belfast, and a surrogate St. Mary's Church in Edinburgh, Scotland, and a surrogate Paramount Chief Tera Waikato Whare Here Here Manaka from Arupuni, Punga Punga Marae, Mangatauteri Mountain in Cambridge, Waikato District, North Island, New Zealand, and his descendant. Paramount Chief Refrefa Manukau from Waiuku on his Manukau Marae there and his <coughs> Upunga Marae at Cornwallis on the north head of the Manukau Harbour and his Manukau Marae on the south head, south inland at Waiuku, his Manukau Marae there. Refere for Manukau <coughs> and his other native court in Awaroa, Helensville. Those two Manukaus I represent as their executor of the Moriori Manukau Moai Crown Trust. I'm here to represent the Paramount Chief Hori Tikuri from Taheke, Marae, Hokianga and Rawene Native Court where he worked as a Native British land agent, commercial land owner. Referefa Manukau and Tera Waikato Whare Here Here Manukau were commercial landowners. In particular, Tera Waikato Whare Here Here Manukau signed a contract in private in the Admiralty Court Edinburgh with King George IV. They formed the basis of a contract for the whole of New Zealand country, sale and purchase agreement. And Ref Refa Manukau sold Pukikai or Uetawa lands from Clevedon on the east coast over the Bombay Hills to Waioku and Afitu, the Manukau Harbour on the west coast of Auckland province, the provincial title down to the east coast, Uetaha Hapu and my Uetaha chief, to my Matauru Wano chief of that time, to St Mary's Church in Rangitukia, or Tikitiki rather, 
1831, Baker. William B. Baker. Resident Magistrate in Rangitukia. School. Settlement. And birth certificates. Marriage and death certificates. Instruments. That's my ancestor there. Under Toi Kairaka Nukutere, Chief of Higurangi Mountain. So that's a little bit about me. Uh, Tony, Fortune, Lawyer. I've written your letter with everything on it, and including you, Tai Choi, signing those documents, the very ones you didn't sign or seal, he sealed them as an Asian and you as a Caucasian didn't sign them, he as an Asian signed them in the Pacific. He signed for the 227 pages of the book here that I put together and took to him. And we went over it together. And he sealed it. One of these. Anyway, it's somewhere here. I'm not going to go and get it if I can't find it. Here it is. This one. Tony, this is the book that you type Troy. Sorry. <coughs> all these pages. He signed them all. Hmm? That much. Because it's true. I'm telling you the truth. And nothing but the truth, so help me God. Everything I say is the truth. But you could not seal it. And he did. Okay, I'm just trying to find the seal that he's put together for me. I thought you were going to do the same thing, but no. You had my documents for over four weeks. There. Okay? Seal. Over here. I've got the real copy, but I put it in here because I stitched the whole lot together in here. With John Key's name in the box right here. He said, Whose name goes in the box? I said, John King. Okay, so he signed it. Right there. The same signature is right here. I owe him for that. Because he was honourable. I'm not saying that you're not honourable, but I'm saying he did due diligence to identify who I am and signed and sealed it. Yu Tai Choi, Certificate of Authenticating Documents to all to whom these presents shall come. I, Yu Tai Choi of Auckland in New Zealand, Notary Public, duly authorised, admitted and sworn and practising within New Zealand do hereby certify 1. On the 29th of August 2013, John Hawani Wānoa in capitals, a resident of Auckland, attended on me and sufficiently identified himself to me. 2. He produced to me the following document. A. Application for default lien data sale of ship and other property and business. 3. I verify that the above named document is an original document and that the signatures thereunto subscribed were subscribed in my presence. 4. I have affixed my seal to each document and to the copies thereof and have initialed the same for the purposes of authenticating them. In testimony whereof I have 
here and to subscribe my name and affix my seal of office at Auckland of Forsaid this 29th day of August 2013 in faith and testimony Notary Public Auckland New Zealand Utah Choi All documents are Moai Crown State Trademark Brand Name Patent Copyrighted Protected as Hoani Kahaki C for copyright Wanoa Lien and Dickman SS Warrants and the seals are here of the two chiefs that went to England with King George the Fourth. Okay, these seals here are King George the Fourth and King William the Fourth. So there you go. Right here. And it's the heading the High Sheriff's Association of England and Wales. Moai Crown King William IV Admiralty County Courts. Commonwealth of Altair, New Zealand Pacific World. Westminster Parliament, England, UK, 1830-1837. High Court of Admiralty, Martial Law, 1830-2015. King's Bench, Property Search and Seizure Arrest Warrants. That's what that is. It will seize anything off pirates. Now, in this letter, I'll just, I'm not going to read it out, I'll read it on another video, but this video was just to you. They identify who I am in the public arena around the world on YouTube video and Facebook, Google, and Twitter. Especially so on Twitter now. I'm going on to show what is happening here in New Zealand at the moment with Obama, Barack Obama coming here and John Key and Hillary Clinton, the three most terrorist, terrorist criminals are here on this land with the Prime Minister of New Zealand, Jacinda Ardern and Deputy Prime Minister Winston Peters. We've got a, a whole lot of fraud corrupted business going on in this country, my land they're on, committing treason again. John Key's Panama Papers, I've already got him for treason. We're coming after you, John Key. That's what I'm saying to you, uh, Tony Fortune. I'm going after every criminal with this flag. This is for criminals, fraudsters on the high sea. This King's flag is not anybody else's business to tamper around as third party with a two-party contract with the British Royal Navy, King's, Emperor's, Flag, Creditor, Bank, Trading, Commercial, Private Contract, Flag of the Military. Protection to seize on any land, any country that has administered their business under this authority of King's, Bench Courts, Royal Revenue and price positions that have been corporatized and stolen. We're going after them, Tony. We're going after them. I have that legal authority as a commercial landowner of New Zealand to recover all debts with a private investigator or debt collector registered debt collector here with this book here is the law of the land because right till now no one has refuted anything I'm saying. I put this certificate on this letter I'm sending you which is a notice that one or the other corporate crown under the Queen Victoria and Queen Elizabeth II and the Maori government and this government of New Zealand has defrauded the people of New Zealand of their country, their land, its natural resources and here they are as a private interest company, John Key, Obama acting for America, booted out of America and still acting under America is liable. Trump, he has libeled Trump and Trump has libeled 
Obama, and they've all rivaled each other and the United Nations, where all the racket is coming from, and the EU Parliament, where the racket is coming from, using the King's Admiralty Court Martial laws for defrauding and corrupting their own law systems using the King's authority, ruling authority, and jurisdiction. So, Tony, I've put the names down before, during and after the offence that is about to be committed on these lands, my lands. I'm saying it's my ancestor lands. I'm their successor. I can speak for myself. I'm speaking for the King and the Paramount Chiefs, their documents, their flag and my authority as an eight-point star St. Patrick. Order. I just want to tell you that we're serious about what we're doing here. We're serious, deadly serious. I want to put my hand on just to show my authority when I find it, if I find it. Someone here. Oop. So, Tony, this is my authority. The eight point star on this flag, four corners of the earth, northeast, southwest, the blue sea and the blue sky, Sea of Admiralty, martial law, eight point star, municipalities act to collect all the rent, the lease of the lands, the leases, the administrative costs to run our business to recover all the debt that's been caused by your administration government in Wellington and its Maori government that's starting up in Devonport. I was there at the meeting <coughs> on Saturday at 5 o'clock in Bayswater Street and there the Maori government set up. They're going to get the bill with this eight point star and their flag from me and the Paramount Chiefs because they are going along with the next.